Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Taylor, and in today's video, I am going to be doing another fashion video with Princess Polly. Last time we went on a date, we all remember we went on a little date, we went to Nobu. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. Um, but in today's video, we're going to be taking a trip to the Hamptons. You know, just a little weekend getaway, casual. So this is what I'd wear if I was rich and going to my house on the Hamptons for the weekend. Princess Polly edition. Let's get into it. First, I would probably spend my first day in the Hamptons. Obviously, first day of vacation, you just want to relax. You know, you don't want to be doing a bunch of stuff. So this is my outfit for, my, minus the hat. The hat is not included. Just need to clarify that. So this is me sitting by the pool, telling my assistant to get me a ginger kombucha in my Crate and Barrel etched wine glass because I refuse to drink it out of the bottle. Here is said Crate and Barrel etched wine glass. I'm kind of obsessed with it. Like I kind of want it, even though I don't even drink alcohol, but I do want to drink my kombuchas out of it and maybe like garnish you know put a little lemon slice a little something ah uh, it would just be so beautiful and that's the kombucha I would pick obviously the health aid kombucha because the GT's kombucha it has like the sediments in it and I just so that's gonna be how I'm spending my first day in the Hamptons just sitting by the pool and the, I didn't even talk about the actual outfit I literally said nothing about the outfit I was so focused on the crate and barrel wine glass so the outfit is just like a, a sheer like white linen-y outfit, like a two-piece set, very casual, loungy. Like I'm not like trying to get a tan. I Maybe I'm just like sitting under like an umbrella. Like I'm not like laying out by the pool. We'll get to that in the next slide. I'm just like sitting outside under my big cabana, probably on some nice like blue and white striped, like classy, like patio furniture. No, it'd probably be black and white striped. Oh, black and white striped. Oh my, oh my God, I'm manifesting that. Okay, so this is the set that I'll be doing for that. Gorgeous, I can see, oh, I can just like picture myself there. As you guys know, I do use these videos as like manifestation purposes. Like I'm manifesting this into my life and it is a full moon today. Full moon in Aquarius, actually very rare full moon in Aquarius because our last full moon was also in Aquarius. So that's two full moons in Leo season, but, but, but I won't get into astrology in this video, okay? Astrology is one thing and then this, we're not going to get into it. But if you want more astrology videos, I also do those kind of videos so you can feel free to subscribe. Next, this is going to be our pool day. You know, we've gotten into the Hamptons, we've lounged, we've adjusted, we had our kombucha, and now we're ready to get a tan. However... We all know this is your family's Hamptons house, so your rich grandpa is probably going to be there. So you don't really want to pull out like the string triangle bikini. So I went with this more modest option. It's a nice blue color. I feel like that color blue, it's almost like a periwinkle, but like not really. It's like if blue and periwinkle had a baby. Royal blue and periwinkle had a baby, right? So I chose this one because it is a bit more modest and it's kind of like ruched. And whenever I think of Hamptons, I think of just like the like little ruched, you know, like a little ruchy ruche. So... That's why I chose this. And this is the pool that I picture myself lounging at in this bikini. Like, isn't that so gorgeous? I love how it doesn't have, it's like, just like pool, like in the middle of grass and there's like flowers and like bushes and shrubbery. I love a good shrubbery, like a nice, like English 1500s castle, like gardening shrubbery vibe. I'm obsessed. I just love this pool and like the chairs, the white umbrellas, if they were black and white striped, wouldn't that be a vibe, you guys? I just, uh, oh my God. Okay, so that's that's day two in the Hamptons. And then later on that day, you all know like the post outside tanning, now you're going to dinner with the family. Again, this blue color, I just feel like it screams the Hamptons to me. So I would choose any of these dresses. I love the middle one like so much and it also comes in orange. But I feel like it is a little bit basic, so I want to spice it up for you guys, give you guys some other options. So I, this one over here on to um, left, right, the left, over on the left, you are showing a little bit more skin, but like it's fine. It's not too risque. And then the one on the, and the one on the, the one on the right, why can't I think of left and right? The one on the right, I feel like it's a little bit more, it's like tight and it kind of has like a, a swoop down. Like a, like a, like a v-neck type thing. So it's like a little bit more sassy, shall I say. Um, but I love it. I love the color. She looks gorgeous in it. Uh, I just, this blue color. That's what I'd wear to dinner with the fam. And like a white purse. Like imagine like a little white purse. Okay. Ah, uh, this day in the Hamptons is my favorite day. A relaxing yacht day. Oh, I love being on my yacht in the Hamptons. I'm obsessed with this dress. I love crochet. Imagine, I just thought of these last night. Imagine if you had like a matching crochet little like head wrap scarf thing. Ah, oh my God. Oh my God, it'd be so cute. But I'm obsessed with these dresses. They're so cute. There's this one from Aritzia. 
It's like $170 or something, but it's just like literally to die for. This is obviously what I would wear on the yacht with like a bikini underneath. I love like the black underneath that she has going. I would probably do like maybe like a black or like a white, like a white on white moment. That'd be kind of hot too. Cause I feel like black isn't so much Hamptons. Like dark colors aren't Hamptons. It's like white and blue. So maybe I do a white on white. Oh, I just love it. Oh my God, it's so cute with like gold jewelry and everything. Oh my God, don't even. And these are pics of me on my said yacht. Oh, I look so happy and thriving queen. Next, this is probably the outfit that I would wear to go get a $7 coffee. Like the next day, like maybe like, well, I wouldn't be like hungover, but like I'm maybe like tired from like my long day out in the sun on the yacht, you know? And so like, this is me. I woke up a little late. I put on this little outfit and I'm going out to get my coffee. You know, I want to treat myself to a little $7 little beverage on this fine morning on my day four in the Hamptons to get me ready for all the fun that's ahead. Ah, let's see. And this is a little bit more risque, but it's like casual risque. It's like, oh, I just rolled out of bed risque. You know what I'm saying? It's not like I am, like I would have like no makeup on, you know, just like sun kissed, whatever. These are the accessories that I'll be wearing. So first of all, the heeled flip flops give me such rich mom vibes. And I feel like the whole vibes for the Hamptons is just rich mom. And these flip flop sandals, they speak it without saying any words. And then for the ring and the earrings, I did like a textured gold. I just feel like that like textured, like thick, chunky gold is very much Hamptons. I feel like the blingy, like the sparkly is not so much Hamptons. That's more New York City. Next, ugh. After you got your coffee, you're obviously going to brunch with the girlies. This outfit is definitely the most frisky of all of them, but you're with the girlies. Your, your rich grandpa is not seeing you in this outfit. I love it. It's very like, you know, you're showing some skin, but it's very like dainty. Like the skirt, it's like mid calf, you know, little ribbons on the shoulders. I think it's perfect, especially if it's like really hot and it's just like summer, like August heat or like July heat. Next, oh my God, maybe, I don't know if I would be doing all of this in one day. No, this is gonna be my busy day on the Hamptons. Day four is the busy day. So next I'm going to tennis at the country club, of course. And this is what I would wear, a little white tennis skirt, a little hoodie, because I'm not actually gonna be playing tennis. I'm just gonna be watching. I'm gonna be taking Instagram stories. I'm gonna be making my mom take Instagram pictures of me. So I'm not gonna be wearing like a whole tennis get up. I'm just gonna be wearing like the hoodie and I'm gonna be like sitting on the sidelines, just kind of like taking in the ambiance and the aesthetic and the atmosphere. And to finish off day four of my Hamptons getaway, going out for sushi for my rich bestie's birthday. Obviously you and your bestie girls are here together. Like all of you and your besties all have, all are at their rich grandpa's Hamptons houses for the weekend. And it's one of your girlies birthdays. She's a Leo obviously, cause I'm a Libra. She's a Leo. It makes perfect sense. Cause it's, you know, it's July, August season. And this is a sushi we would get. Oh my God. I literally had sushi yesterday. It was so, it was so amazing. But you would obviously go out for sushi. You'd be like sitting outside. And this dress I think is so cute. It screams Hamptons. It screams fun, modest night with the girlies. You know, we're having a kombucha booch. You're taking IG pics. It's a great time. So you guys, that was my OOTD for my four day luxury vacation to the Hamptons. We had a little yacht day. We had a brunch moment, a coffee moment, a dinner moment, a pool moment. Uh, what else did we have? We had many moments in the Hamptons. That's it. Let me know what you guys thought of my outfits. Let me know what else you would do in the Hamptons. Let's manifest it down below. Um, I hope you guys like this video. And if you want to see more videos like this, tell me what other scenarios we should do in the comments. You guys, come on. Like I want to whip these out for you guys. You know, I love a good PowerPoint moment. I love making PowerPoints. Yeah. Thanks so much for watching you guys. If you like these types of videos, make sure you give it a thumbs up, comment down below and subscribe. We're almost at 5k. So exciting. So crazy. Thank you guys so much, but I will see you guys in my next video or on Instagram. If you follow me on Instagram and if you don't, you should, cause I post a bunch of fashion stuff like this on there too. So follow me on there if you don't, but thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. You got it, girl, you got it No, baby, in a bag, in a Birkin No, not a bag, but you're working Cause I know I love a mom for me a burger Baby, girl, you got it, girl, you got it, girl You got it, girl, you got it, girl